News of former First Lady Rosalind Carter's battle with dementia has sparked discussion about how to treat those who have the disease. WALB News 10's Anthony Portanero has what you need to know about a diagnosis and what you should do to prevent and treat the disease. Rosalind Carter has spent nearly four decades promoting research and discussion about brain health. We really applaud the Carter family for their transparency. We often find that people suffer in silence. Leslie Holland stresses that the sooner you can identify symptoms, the better. She says as early as 45, you should ask your doctor for a cognitive test. If anything, she says it's a baseline for future years. We are seeing so many people who are being diagnosed with dementia and um, all forms of it much earlier and earlier. Holland says significant progress is being made for treatments for early onset dementia. Rosalind Carter Institute for Caregivers continues to make progress for treatment as well. Just a couple of weeks ago, President Biden announced the largest executive order ever focused on care. And this included child care, caregiving like what we are talking about and the paid care workforce. Holland says there are clear signs to look for with Alzheimer's that isn't just a case of getting old. Challenges in problem solving, confusion with time and place, visual images, and some of that depth perception and spatial relationships um, changes, behavior can change. Holland thinks COVID isolation had an impact on case numbers. She says that staying social and active are ways to keep the brain sharp and to delay the disease. Puzzles or, you know, maybe you like to do a sport or weightlifting and other exercise. Um, interaction with, you know, with friends. She also says the Mediterranean diet has been shown to be really good for brain health. Later on our website, I'll provide links to some resources that could help you and your loved ones who may have dementia. Anthony Bornaro, WALB, your hometown news source. Representative Buddy Carter also responded after the news broke about Rosalind Carter. He said, quote, Rosalind Carter is a champion for mental health. Each year, the Rosalind Carter Caregiver of the Year Award is presented to caregivers nationwide that share her dedication to putting others <clears throat> before self. I wish her and her family comfort and peace during this most difficult time, end quote.